हेलो एवरीवन आई एम अंकित कुमार एंड आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू एजुकेशन सर्किट एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट करंट अफेयर्स फॉर योर ऑल कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जामिनेशंस लाइक एफ कैट सी डी एस एन डी ए टू टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी वन एंड वट एवर पॉइंट्स वी आर गोइंग टू कवर दीज ऑल पॉइंट्स विल बी वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट यू विल डेफिनेटली सी डायरेक्ट क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम दिस वीडियो इन योर कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जामिनेशन लास्ट टाइम ए लॉट ऑफ क्वेश्चन केम फ्रॉम आर सीरीज एंड आई विल शो यू द प्रूफ ऑफ इट इन दिस वीडियो अहेड एंड वी आर गोइंग टू कवर दीज ऑल वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट करंट अफेयर्स वेरी कंसाइसली मोर इंफॉर्मेशन इन लेस टाइम नॉट ब्लदरिंग लाइक वन आर एंड वन एंड हाफ आर लॉन्ग वीडियो ओके इट विल बी वेरी कंसाइसली एंड वट एवर पॉइंट वी आर गोइंग टू कवर प्लीज लिसन टू एवरी सिंगल पॉइंट वेरी अटेंटिवली एंड केयरफुली बिकॉज एवरी पॉइंट इज ए क्वेश्चन इट सेल्फ ओके सो लेट स्टार्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर वन इज Who has become the first cricketer to score three thousand runs in T Twenty international cricket? Okay, so recently, Virat Kohli of India has become the first cricketer to score three thousand runs in T Twenty international cricket, and he has also become the fastest cricketer to score three thousand runs in T Twenty international cricket. Okay, he achieved this milestone. against england at ahmedabad in march 2021 in a t20 match and he took 87 innings to achieve this milestone okay and if we talk about fastest 1000 runs so fastest 1000 runs in t20 international cricket are scored by mr david malan of england and he also achieved that milestone in the same match at ahmedabad in india during march 2021 t20 series between india and england and he took 24 innings for achieving this milestone of scoring 1000 t20 international runs which are fastest in the world okay this question is very very important that who is fastest and first cricketer to score 3000 international runs in t20 cricket so he is mr virat kohli from india and you are well aware about him okay let's move on question number 2 is recently india has launched the official olympic theme song of india for tokyo olympic games what is the name of this song means for tokyo olympic games which are going to be conducted from july to august 2021 which is the edition of olympic 2020 but just because of corona virus these games have been postponed to 2021 and now these games are going to be held in tokyo japan so for motivating indian athletes and participants who are going to take participation in olympic games 2020 in uh, tokyo japan so an official olympic theme song has been made so what is the name of this song okay so the name of this song is tu thaan le and it was composed and performed by famous indian musician and vocalist mr mohit chauhan and this song was launched by sports minister mr kiran rizuju on 23rd of june 2021 and more than 100 players have qualified for tokyo olympic 2020 edition which is going to be held in 2021 from july to august okay this question is very very important and question related to olympic games are very important all the times okay so please don't miss any question related to olympic games and we are going to cover some more important information about olympic games in this video ahead so please don't skip and don't miss any point okay and let me tell you one more thing last time a lot of questions came from our current affairs series from a single video three four questions as it is direct questions came in nd examinations and other examinations like cds and fcat you can see the comments of candidates who commented these comment after appearing in their examinations okay we cover only very very important current affairs which are very prone to be asked in your competitive examinations and from which questions of set pattern are asked every year in your examinations okay so we make questions by doing analysis on previous years question papers and from which questions are asked every year so we cover only those points right so whatever questions we are going to cover and we are covering nowadays in our series so please don't miss any question every question is very very important right you can see the proof here okay let's move on
क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री इज वॉट वॉज द वेन्यू ऑफ इंडिया थाईलैंड कोऑर्डिनेटेड पेट्रोल विच इज ऑल्सो नॉन एज कोरपैट टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी वन ज्वाइंट नेवल एक्सरसाइज इन कोरपैट सी ओ आर इज टेकन फ्रॉम कोऑर्डिनेटेड एंड पी ए टी इज टेकन फ्रॉम पेट्रोल राइट सो द नेम ऑफ दिस नेवल एक्सरसाइज इज कोरपैट सो द क्वेश्चन इज द एडिशन ऑफ टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी वन ऑफ दिस एक्सरसाइज वेयर इट वॉज हेल्ड ओके मीन्स वट इज द वेन्यू ऑफ दिस ज्वाइंट नेवल एक्सरसाइज सो कोरपैट इज अ ज्वाइंट नेवल एक्सरसाइज बिटवीन इंडियन नेवी एंड रॉयल थाय नेवी एंड दिस टाइम इन टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी वन इट वॉज कंडक्टेड इन अंडमान सी फ्रॉम नाइन्थ ऑफ जून टू इलेवंथ ऑफ जून टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी वन एंड इट वॉज इट्स थर्टी फर्स्ट एडिशन ओके वॉट एवर पॉइंट्स वी आर कवरिंग इन ए क्वेश्चन दीज ऑल पॉइंट्स आर वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट लाइक फ्रॉम ए ज्वाइंट नेवल एक्सरसाइज देर आर मेनी क्वेश्चन आस्ट फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज वेयर इट वॉज कंडक्टेड मीन्स वेन्यू एंड सेकेंड क्वेश्चन इज बिटवीन विच कंट्रीज दिस एक्सरसाइज इज कंडक्टेड सो दिस एक्सरसाइज इज कंडक्टेड बिटवीन इंडियन नेवी एंड द रॉयल था नेवी एंड थर्ड मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन इज वॉट वॉज इट्स एडिशन ओके सो इट वॉज इट्स थर्टी फर्स्ट एडिशन सो दिस क्वेश्चन इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू ज्वाइंट मिलिट्री एक्सरसाइजेज आर ऑफन आस्ट इन ऑल कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जामिनेशन नॉट ओनली इन डिफेंस एग्जामिनेशन ओके एंड आई हैव ऑलरेडी मेड अ सेपरेट वीडियो ऑन ऑल मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट ज्वाइंट मिलिट्री एक्सरसाइजेज इफ यू हैव नॉट वॉच दैम यट सो प्लीज मस्ट गो थ्रू इट यू विल डेफिनेटली सी क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम दिस वीडियो ओके लेट्स मूव अड क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर इज रिसेंटली विच स्टेट ऑफ इंडिया हैज गोट फिफ्टी सेकेंड टाइगर रिजर्व ऑफ द कंट्री ओके मीन्स रिसेंटली अ स्टेट हैज गोट फिफ्टी सेकेंड टाइगर रिजर्व ऑफ द कंट्री दैट मीन्स बिफोर इट देर वर टोटल फिफ्टी वन टाइगर रिजर्व इन इंडिया एंड दिस इज फिफ्टी सेकेंड सो क्वेश्चन इज विच स्टेट हैज गॉट दिस फिफ्टी सेकेंड टाइगर रिजर्व सो रामगढ़ वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरी ऑफ राजस्थान has been declared as 52nd tiger reserve of the country and it is given that status by ntca means national tiger conservation authority and by having this tiger reserve rajasthan has got total four tiger reserves before this there were three more tiger reserves in rajasthan which are ranthambore sariska and mukundra tiger reserve okay this question 2 is very very important remember ladies and gentlemen whatever questions we are covering these all questions are very very important and you can make short notes also and more such topics from which questions of set pattern are asked in your competitive examinations every year like padma awards bharat ratna nobel prize gallantry awards miss world miss universe khel ratna oscar award and grammy awards etc we have already made videos on these all topics and these all topics are very very important for your competitive examinations perspective if you have not gone through these all topics so please must go through them before going to your examination and the link of complete playlist is given in the description box below and link of these videos is given in i button also and these videos are available on end screen in the end of this video okay let's move on Question number five is who was the winner of Miss Earth 2020 Beauty Pageant? Okay, Miss Earth Beauty Pageant is one of major beauty pageant of the world like Miss World, Miss Universe, Miss Earth, and Miss International. Okay, so questions related to these beauty pageants are very prone to be asked in examinations, and these questions are often asked in all competitive examinations. Okay. so the winner of miss earth 2020 beauty pageant is miss lindsay coffey of the usa and this beauty pageant is first major beauty pageant in the history which was conducted in a virtual mode okay and this edition was 20th edition of miss earth right so you can remember it by 2020 you can take 20 from it so you can relate it with 20 okay so it was its 20th edition and most important point from this question is the winner of this beauty pageant who is miss lindsay coffee of the usa right this question is very very important and this question is prone to be asked in your competitive examinations okay let's move on question number 6 says what is the mascot of summer olympic games 2020 which are going to be held from july to august 2021 okay 
this is very very important question questions related to mascot are often asked in competitive examinations so the mascot of summer olympic games 2020 is mirai tova and mascot of para olympic game is somethi these both mascots are cartoon characters of japan right and summer olympic games are going to be held in tokyo japan right this question is very very important question related to olympic games are very very important okay let's move on question number 7 is who has been appointed as the world bank education advisor starting from june 2021 to june 2024 please mark it very very important right means who has been appointed as the education advisor of world bank right this is very very important question and the reason of being this question very important the person who has been appointed for this position is an indian okay so mr ranjit singh desale has been appointed as the world bank education advisor and he will take charge from june 2021 to june 2024 he will work under this project the name of this project is coach project which is launched by world bank and there is one question for you that where is the headquarter of world bank located okay so please write down the answer of this question in the comment box below right and mr ranjit singh desale is first indian to have been awarded by global teacher award 2020 very very important point okay mr ranjit singh desale is first indian to have been awarded by global teacher award you can see the importance of this question okay at global level at world level he won this award global teacher award last year in 2020 and now this time he has been appointed as the world bank education advisor okay so this question is very very important let's move on and if you like these videos and feeling that points which we are covering are very informative for you so please like these videos and share them with your friends also and if you want more such videos so please write down in the comment box below we will make more such videos and we will continue this series okay and uh, one more thing we have covered three parts of such most important current affairs if you have not watched them yet so please must go through them because we have covered such important questions in these videos this is fourth part of this series okay let's move on question number 8 is who is the winner of world food prize 2021 this question too is very very important and last time this prize was won by indian american scientist mr ratan lal singh ji so question is in 2021 who won this prize okay this is very prestigious prize at world level and this is referred to as nobel prize in food and agriculture okay so in 2021 this prize has been given to dr shakuntala harak singh thilstead and she has been awarded by this prize for her extraordinary work on nutrition fish and aquatic food system okay and she was born in trinidad and tobago and she has nationality of denmark okay and now there is one question for you which is what is the capital of denmark please write down in the comment box below capitals are also very very important for your examinations and every time at least one question is asked from capitals and currency so we will prepare capitals of country side by side in this manner okay let's move on question number 9 is who has won inaugural icc world test championship 2021 icc means international cricket council and world test championship is a championship of test cricket which is played for 5 days and this is oldest format of cricket nowadays there are like t20 one day international and 10 overs game has also been started nowadays so world test championship it was its first edition so the question is who is the winner of this world test championship okay so the winner of this world test championship is new zealand and new zealand won this title by defeating india in final by 8 wickets and this match was played at southampton of england and this championship started in august 2019 from a match between australia and england which was the match of ashes series and it was ended in june 2021 
विद ए मैच बिटवीन इंडिया एंड न्यूजीलैंड एट साउथ एम्पटन ऑफ इंग्लैंड राइट दिस क्वेश्चन इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट बिकॉज इट वॉज इट्स फर्स्ट एडिशन एंड इंडिया प्लेड द फाइनल एंड इंडिया लॉस्ट न्यूजीलैंड वन दिस टाइटल ओके सो दिस क्वेश्चन बिकम्स वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट लेट्स मूव अड क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन इज रिसेंटली हु हैज बीन अपॉइंटेड एज द हाई कमिश्नर ऑफ इंडिया टू द रिपब्लिक ऑफ जोम्बिया दिस क्वेश्चन टू इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ओके सो मिस्टर अशोक कुमार हैज बीन अपॉइंटेड एज द हाई कमिश्नर ऑफ इंडिया टू द रिपब्लिक ऑफ जोम्बिया एंड बिफोर टेकिंग द चार्ज ऑफ दिस पोस्ट ही वॉज एम्बेसडर ऑफ इंडिया टू द रिपब्लिक ऑफ जिबूती ओके नाउ देर आर टू क्वेश्चन फॉर यू वॉट आर द कैपिटल्स ऑफ जोम्बिया एंड जिबूती एंड इन विच कॉन्टिनेंट जिबूती इज सिचुएटेड ओके यू नीड टू राइट डाउन द आंसर ऑफ दीज क्वेश्चन राइट वॉट एवर क्वेश्चन वी आर कवरिंग दीज ऑल क्वेश्चन आर वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड देर विल नॉट बी एनी एक्स्ट्रा क्वेश्चन विच इज नॉट इंपॉर्टेंट ओके चलिए आगे बढ़ते हैं क्वेश्चन नंबर इलेवन इज हु हैज बिकम द फर्स्ट रेसिपियंट ऑफ मुलग मेडल सी मुलग मेडल इज ए मेडल विच इज प्रेजेंटेड बाय क्रिकेट ऑस्ट्रेलिया इन क्रिकेट मैचेस एंड इट इज गिवन इन द ऑनर ऑफ फॉर्मर ऑस्ट्रेलियन क्रिकेटर मिस्टर जोनी मुलग एंड दिस मेडल हैज बीन स्टार्टेड गिविंग इन 2020 सो इन 2020 इट वाज गिवन टू ए प्लेयर फर्स्ट टाइम सो क्वेश्चन इज फर्स्ट टाइम हु वॉज गिवन दिस मेडल राइट सो इंडिया वॉज ऑन टूर ऑफ ऑस्ट्रेलिया एंड इंडिया डिफिटेड ऑस्ट्रेलिया सो इन दिस सीरीज दिस मेडल वॉज गिवन टू दैन करंट कैप्टन ऑफ इंडियन टेस्ट क्रिकेट टीम मिस्टर अजिंक्य रहाने एंड वन मोर थिंग दिस मेडल इज गिवन फॉर बॉक्सिंग डे मैच ओनली ओके बॉक्सिंग डे मैच इज ए टेस्ट मैच विच इज कंडक्टेड वंस इन ए ईयर इन ऑस्ट्रेलिया ओके so the first recipient of this medal is mr ajinkya rahane and he got this medal on 29th of december 2020 last year okay so this question is very very important for your all competitive examinations whatever examination you are going to face in 2021 right let's move on question number 12 is what is the rank of india in global peace index 2021 this question too is very very important questions related to index and rankings of countries are often asked in all competitive examinations and question related to global peace index is often asked okay it is very important question so out of 163 countries india got 135th position you can see the situation of india this is very embarrassing this index tells how much peaceful a country is okay so you can see the situation of india and ireland was on first position and new zealand was on second position and denmark was on third position okay and ireland has been most peaceful country since 2008 and it was its 15th edition okay whatever points we are covering these all are very very important which country got first position it is ireland and india got 135th rank and it was its 15th edition and this time in 2021 this index was released by institute of economics and peace sydney australia okay this question is very very important so please memorize this question okay let's move on and for getting more such videos click on subscribe button and active all notifications by clicking on bell icon so you can get all very important videos related to most important questions and you can also get videos about ssb interview strategy about every test how to crack how to perform well and how to crack ssb okay so next question is who is the winner of european inventor award 2021 this question is very very important right european inventor award is presented by european patent office and it is given to those inventors who make significant contribution to innovation economy and society in europe okay so in 2021 indian american chemist Mrs Sumita Mitra has been awarded by European Inventor Award in the category of non CPO right CPO means European Patent Office okay so this question is very important because an Indian American person is winning this award in Europe right so this is very important question who is the winner of this award Mrs Sumita Mitra okay got it i hope you have got it let's move on question number 14 is Ayush Ministry has launched which app to promote yoga 
so on the occasion of international yoga day to conduct yoga day virtually ayush ministry launched namaste yoga app and the main purpose of this app is to raise awareness about yoga and make it accessible to the larger community okay and by using this app we can look at yoga centers we can find out trainers and events and it was seventh edition of international yoga day right theme of 2021 international yoga day was be with yoga be at home right this theme is very very important okay this theme can be asked in your examination so whatever points we have covered these all points are very very important which edition of international yoga day was this it was seventh edition and the theme of this time means 2021 international yoga day is be with yoga be at home and the name of app is namaste yoga okay chaliye aage badhte hain question number 15 is who is the author of the book star gazing the players in my life this question too is very very important and this book is authored by former indian cricketer commentator and current head coach of indian cricket team mr ravi shastri okay this book is very very important and you may face question related to this book in your examination so what is the name of this book it is star gazing the players in my life and who is the author of this book he is mr ravi shastri राइट right? चलिए आगे बढ़ते हैं क्वेश्चन नंबर 16 इज रिसेंटली फ्रांस हैज लॉन्च इट्स फर्स्ट स्पेस मिलिट्री एक्सरसाइज व्हाट इज द नेम ऑफ दिस एक्सरसाइज सो रिसेंटली फ्रांस हैज लॉन्च ए स्पेस मिलिट्री एक्सरसाइज टू डिफेंड इट्स सैटेलाइट एंड मिलिट्री इक्विपमेंट्स फ्रॉम एन अटैक फ्रॉम एयर एंड द नेम ऑफ दिस एक्सरसाइज इज एस्टर एक्स एंड दिस नेम वाज गिवन इन द मेमोरी ऑफ देयर फर्स्ट सैटेलाइट Aster X, which took place in 1965, and this exercise is the first attempt in space, not only by French army, but in Europe, in whole Europe. Okay, France is the only country who has taken this step in Europe, right? So this question too is very very important. What is the name of this exercise? Is Aster X, and this name was given in the memory of their first satellite, which was launched in 1965. and the name of this satellite is aster x okay see this question is very important because this is related to space military exercise right so it becomes very very important we are not talking about joint military exercises and and only a few countries have got this achievement till now right let's move on question number 17 is who is the winner of monaco grand prix 2021 formula 1 race okay questions related to formula 1 race grand prix races are often asked in competitive examinations in the section of gk from sports okay so this time in 2021 mr max verstappen of red bull he won monaco grand prix 2021 and he is a belgian and dutch citizen okay so this question too is very very important and this grand prix took place in june 2021 so the winner of monaco grand prix 2021 is mr max verstappen okay let's move on question number 18 is who has been elected as the new prime minister of israel okay this question too is very very important so mr naftali bennett has been elected 13th prime minister of israel and he is from yamina party his party name is yamina okay and recently israel has got its new president also so what is the name of this person means new president of israel so please write down the answer of this question in comment box below and what is the capital of israel please write down this in the comment box below also okay questions related to appointments and elections are very important and questions related to such points are often asked in your competitive examination and this question is very prone to be asked in your examinations whatever questions we have covered till now in this video these all questions are very very important and you will definitely see as it is same questions in your competitive examinations okay let's move on question number 19 is on which date world olympic day is observed right olympic games are going to be held in japan in 2021 so that is why questions related to olympic games are very important so question is olympic day is observed on which date it was recently observed on 23rd of june and the main motive of celebrating this day is to motivate youth about sports 
and to mark the importance of games and sports in our life and to promote their participation in games and sports across the world okay on which day world olympic day is observed it is observed on 23rd of june right so this question 2 is very very important let's move on question number 20 and last question of this video is which state has got first position in smart city mission of central government okay on completion of six years of smart city mission amrit yojana and pm shahari awas yojana ranking of states of india was released so question is which state of india has got first position in this ranking okay so uttar pradesh has got first position in this list for implementing projects in 10 smart cities of uttar pradesh and madhya pradesh and tamil nadu got second and third position in this list respectively so which state has got first position it is uttar pradesh okay so these all are the very very important current affairs questions and we have covered a lot of points which are questions itself and i hope this video would have been very very informative for you and if you feel that this video is very informative for you so please like this video and share it with your friends also and for getting more such videos don't forget to click on subscribe button and active all notifications by clicking on bell icon and we have already made three parts of this series part one two and three this is fourth one so if you have not gone through these videos till now so please must go through them because all the parts are very very important okay so if you have any query any doubt whatever suggestion you want to give so please write down in the comment box below you are most welcome and all the very best for your written examinations and ssb and that's all for today bye for now